Hey everybody, it's Rob Lowe. Welcome to GQ's Grooming Gods. I'm gonna share with you um, some of the things that I do just to keep myself looking like I look. So first of all, I've come from the gym. I'm gonna take a shower and we'll get started. I raised two sons of my own and teaching them how to groom themselves, giving them all the sort of tricks of the trade that I've had from experts just because of my job. Hey, you need to moisturize even though you're young. I know you, you don't think you need it now, but trust me, the chickens are gonna come home to roost when you're 40 and you'll wish you'd have done it. So the most important thing that most guys don't do, ironically, is wash correctly. This is the first thing I do, face wash by Cobalt, twice a day. So the first thing you gotta do, the basics. Take care of the face, right? Gentle, easy, scrub, rinse, and you are good to go with step one. Taking care of your face is one thing, but if you look down and uh, the legs are not what they need to be, you gotta do something about that. So I, I have always been a big fan of Burt's Bees um, because it feels like it's supercharged. It's really, really gentle, milk and honey, really good for dry skin, which I have. The first place that you look tired is under your eyes. This is our Under Eye Revival Roller Ball. This contains uh, anti-aging uh, properties. Roll it on. I like to actually keep this in the refrigerator in the morning because the little roller ball gets really cool and it's extra soothing. You know, taking care of, of how you look is not this narcissistic thing. It, it really is more emblematic of how you are taking care of yourself holistically. And the, the first step of that is, is what you're doing on, on the inside. And if you're not taking care of yourself on the inside, you're not very likely to take care of yourself on the outside. Frankly, for me, the outside work is easier. It's easier to put a moisturizer on your skin than it is to do kind of inside stuff that we all need to do, but it's a great start. I love being in the sun, but there's nothing that will do more damage to your skin than the sun. Really, really critical to have sunscreen every day. Um, obviously in the in the summertime, it's, it's more important, but um, you know, you gotta rub it in. Look, this is how you know it's really, really, really got the proper amount of coverage. It goes on white, don't be scared. You're not gonna look like a clown. If you take care of yourself, you may not see the results right away, but you're gonna see them eventually. You know, I've been in the best and the brightest makeup and hair chair since I was a kid. You know, and I would never have done that stuff to myself. I wouldn't have sat there and put all the proper stuff on my skin. I wouldn't have done it. But here I am in my mid fifties and I'm seeing the results of the hard work those people did for me. So if I can impart that to other dudes who might not be down to take these proper steps, um, that's really why we're doing this today because um, it's been really beneficial and I have those people to thank who taught me how to do this even when I didn't really want to do it myself. If you're, again, moving quickly through life, you're late and you don't want to get in the shower and do the whole number, the dry shampoo thing is really good. So the one I, I like is a living proof gives you great texture. Look at this, by the way, how cool is this? This is like Apollo 13 action, like where they're making the module move, right? Done, bip, bop, boom. So what dry shampoo actually does is it, it literally shampoos your hair in two seconds. So it reduces the oils. Most guys don't know how to do it. Most guys don't know about it. Now you do. So when I'm going for the more rugged, um, less quaffed, don't give a crap, more rock and roll thing, um, it's really important to have the right hair product in. And I like this shaping paste from Shu Shuamura, and it looks like this. And it almost is a pomade. And my hair sucks stuff up. I have really dry hair, so I have to put tons of it in. So I'm not afraid to really lay it in. Don't be, by the way, how, I like this look. You guys like this look? Yeah, I think it's really good. It's just the first step. And you can see it looks it looks a little, the right amount of like texture. It's not too wet. It's not too dry. Mess it up. Look look rugged. You look more like you don't give a crap. Uh, particularly if you have a really good haircut. 
and um, the good haircut is 80% of it. At night, there's another regimen. You know, 12 hours or eight hours, six hours, even if it's five, whatever it is that you're sleeping, that's a great time to have your skin be moisturized, um, put nutrients on it. Let's finish this off with Profiles Lift Anti-Gravity. It's a very lightweight formula, just nice and easy. I talked earlier about my Revive under eye roller. So at night, I had it one last time under my eyes. That time that I'm gonna be sleeping gives it that extra hours to work. And then I hit you with the greatest invention ever. The sleep mask. Yes, I know it seems a little 50 shades of gray. And you know, you could use it for that too. If you want, I'm not against it, I'm told. But this thing really, really helps the quality of my sleep. And um, here, this is, the, this is the move. I'm tired already. Thank you for this. This has been a, a wonderful moment. Um, I'm, I am now feeling that I am a grooming god. And like all grooming gods, I need my beauty rest. God bless. Thanks, you guys.